Hey everybody, it's Tracy. It's Tuesday, October 30th, which means it's my birthday. Yeah, I turn 50 today. The big 5-0, whatever you, however you want to call it. And so I haven't had much of an opportunity to make a video lately. I had a busy weekend with friends and family. We rented a a lake house and had a long weekend and friends came in from out of town out of state <clears throat> saw my best friend from high school that I hadn't seen in a, a probably around 10 years so um, it was a really really good weekend we had a lot of fun the weather ended up being really really good and um, it was just a lot of fun um, a lot of good a lot of good times, good memories, making uh, good memories with family and friends and everything. So, um, and uh, I'm not really sure, <clears throat> excuse me, if I have any like wonder words of wisdom or anything. Um, I just thought I'd get on and um, talk a little bit um, about um, my weekend and, and how it's going. Uh, yeah, like I said, we rented a lake house and uh, stayed there Thursday night through Sunday night. Um, I was off work yesterday and uh, had a really good time relaxing. There was um, yard games and we had uh, kayaks and um, fishing and just, you know, um, had a lot of, a lot of fun um, friends and, you know, and cooking on the grill and and then Saturday evening, kind of, I guess, had a, an official party. And more friends and family came over. And uh, like I said, more games, playing pool and dancing and all, you know, just having a good time. Um, I'm really blessed with wonderful friends and a great family. And, uh, you know, it doesn't really bother me that I'm turning, that I turned 50 today. Uh, it's just crazy how I got here so fast. I mean, it doesn't, I don't feel like I should be 50. Uh, some of my memories feel like they were, you know, as we say, just yesterday. <clears throat> but, um, I am 50. And, uh, so then yesterday after we came home, uh, my husband and I had lunch, and then um, he dropped me off at a store so I could do some shopping. So you can't see my full outfit, but I got a new outfit on today. And then we went to the movies and saw Stars Born, and that was really good. This version was, was pretty good. Um, it kept the story really close to the 1978 version with Barbara Streisand and Chris Christopherson, uh, which is a good version too. Um, so it was good. And then we uh, took some pictures of my granddaughter in her Halloween costume, and then we had a little dinner. And um, so it was a really good day. And then today I'm back at work and um, they brought in uh, breakfast and we have a cake for later. And so it's been a really good day. I've I haven't worked too fast. I've been kind of slow today because I've been reading posts on Facebook and and everything else for more friends and stuff. I think it's what one o'clock in the afternoon, and I have probably over I have over a hundred posts already on my Facebook, um, wishing me happy birthday and stuff. So it's really really good. A lot of good friends. It was so great having my friend um, from high school. She lives in Tennessee now. So it was really great having her in town and we uh, drove through our old stomping ground and recreated some pictures um, from high school because we were both on the dance team. Uh, so it was a lot of fun, a lot of fun. Um, tonight, I don't know, I guess, you know, my husband and I will go to dinner. I, I really, we haven't really talked about what we're doing this evening. Um, of course, one of my favorite shows is on today and <laughs> This Is Us is on tonight, so, but I can record that. Of course, it's set to record every week. <laughs> so, yeah, 50. All I can say is, over the years, I've learned, you know, 
don't take life for granted. Don't take anything for granted. Your loved ones, your friends, life, your job, your home, um, your education, anything. You know, especially your loved ones, your spouse. Don't take anything for granted because things can change in an instant. Life can change with a phone call. Um, you know, anything car ride anything you know life is short it, the days go by slow but I'm telling you the years go by so fast and you need to just take it in and try to find something positive every day at the end of the day try to find something positive from that day don't stay you know bogged down in in the negative because there's always something good that happened that day. Something you can find positive for that day. And just try to focus on that as you wind your day down. Um, and then start each day being thankful and grateful for your blessings and for another day. And just keep in touch with family and friends and loved ones and just because it goes by so fast and you know, next thing you know, another year's passed or two and maybe you haven't talked to this person or seen this family member or whatever and, um, you know, you just, you need to cherish, cherish those people in your life, the good people. And if there's toxic people or if something happens or whatever, if it's best, you know, cut them out of your life. Don't hold on to all that negativity or people that are bring negativity to you or hurt you or um, take advantage of you. It's okay to take care of yourself. It's okay to um, say no. And it's okay to live your life to the fullest. Just as long as you're not hurting anybody, then do what you want to do. Do what you love. Take chances. Go on adventures. Buy the concert tickets. You know, do those things that you love, but just don't take anybody for granted while you're doing it. So, like I said, I just wanted to get on here for a few minutes. I hadn't been able to post a video. And, um, like I said, I don't know if those are words of wisdom or not. Or, it's, you know, it's just how I feel. It's how I see things after all these years you know I've made some big mistakes and I've had to ask for forgiveness and I've made amends and I've survived a lot of things and um, I'm just who I am and I'm grateful I'm grateful for my family and my friends and my husband my job my home and um, life is good it really is and I'm just so blessed and 50 is not bad. I think every birthday card that I got this weekend and even today, the front, every card's different, but in design, you know, whatever the look of the card is. But I think every single card I got this weekend, on the front of it, it says 50 is the new fabulous. So, you know, I don't know. I think somebody's trying to tell me something. Um, because, like I said, every single card on the front said 50 is the new fabulous. Hmm. I think I need to hold on to that and remember that, remind myself of that. Because it's not that bad. It's really not. There's still so much to do and so much to enjoy. Grandkids and family and just everything. Friends. And for me, the holidays are coming up. Decorating for Christmas. So, you know, life is good. And, um, you know, people think they, you know, they look for the purpose in life or what's the point of this life. The point of this life, your purpose in life is to have a relationship with God and to live your life well and just be the best that you can be. And I hope that all of you can find that and realize that whether you're 50 or not and take care of yourself I'll see you later that's a dose of me